Welcome to Clockify, an app that lets you and your team track time and analyze where it goes. So let's go over everything you can do with Clockify. Track your time using the timer. Or enter your time manually by switching to manual mode. Categorize your time by adding a description, tying it to a project or task, adding tags, or marking the entry as billable or non-billable. You can also track the time you spend on a break using break mode. Another way to log time is entering your time in the timesheet. Just select a project or a task and enter time in the cells. Hover over a cell and click to add more information. Navigate to other weeks. Save templates to reuse recorded projects and time. Then simply apply and finally submit the timesheet for manager's approval. All your track time will appear in the calendar, so you can see if you have gaps or overlaps. You can edit time by manipulating blocks and connect to your Google or Outlook calendar in order to create time entries from events or start tracking time on them. Use the kiosk to clock in with your personal PIN code from a shared device. Track employee breaks. See how much you've worked. And switch between projects. Besides tracking time in a browser, you can also install Clockify on your computer or phone. The mobile app lets you track time using a timer, Add time manually, track expenses, and request time off. With the desktop app, you get additional features like reminders, the Pomodoro timer, auto start and stop, idle detection, and more. Besides these, the auto tracker will help you keep track of what apps and websites you spend your time on so you can convert that time into time entries. Tracking time on the mobile and desktop apps is possible even without an internet connection, and that time will be synced as soon as the connection is restored. And finally, you can use the browser extension to quickly track time inside other web apps like Playkey, Gmail, Google Docs, Trello, Asana, and more. Clockify lets you track all your business expenses, create expenses, categorize them, and enter the amount. You can also add a note and attach the receipt. If you choose a category with a unit price, you can enter the unit instead. You can also see other people's expenses here and define as many categories as your business needs. The Time Off page is where you see and approve your team's time off requests. There you can define non-working holidays and define your own time off policies like paid vacation, sick leave, and so on. When your team requests time off, they choose a policy and date range, and a request then appears on the Timeline tab, helping you visualize who's absent and when. In the Balance tab, you can see everyone's balance broken down by policy or user, adjust someone's balance, or see a detailed history of changes. Now let's see different ways you can analyze data with Clockify. The dashboard shows you a visual breakdown of your own or your team's track time at a glance. Plus, you can see what each person is currently working on. For more options, there are reports. 
The summary report shows you all track time broken down by week, month, or any custom period you need. The bar chart shows track time for each day, and below is a table with custom breakdowns. See internal cost and profit, plus time estimates and budgets if they're set. You can use filters to see specific data and download the customizable report in PDF, CSV, and Excel, or create a link to it, which you can send to others. The detailed report shows you all individual time entries, which you can edit with ease. The weekly report shows you a timesheet-like breakdown by user and project, plus it lets you see who forgot to track any time. The attendance report gives you insight on the amount of time members worked in a day and calculates overtime based on their work capacity. The assignments report lets you compare schedule to track time. And finally, in the expense report, you can see all tracked expenses and receipts as well as edit and export them. Approval of submitted timesheets can be done on the approval page. Remind managers to review their team's timesheets, approve everything yourself, or open a request to review it in more detail. Once you're done, you can approve or reject it from there. See who forgot to submit their timesheet for each week and send them an email reminder and see all approved and withdrawn timesheets in the Archive tab. On the Projects page, you can create projects to categorize time, sort projects by progress, and archive the ones you no longer need. Each project can be broken down into tasks so people can subcategorize their activity. Assign people to tasks so only assignees can track time on them set an hourly rate, and finally mark tasks you no longer need as done. In the Access tab, you can choose who can access the project and set more specific hourly rates. In the Status tab, you can compare estimated versus track time, see overall progress, and check if some task is over budget. Visualize project progress and get predictions based on tracked and scheduled work in the Forecast tab. And in the Note tab, you can enter custom information like project documentation. And lastly, in the Settings tab, you can change project info like client and color, set project's hourly rate, add an estimate or budget, and link any custom fields you might have to the project. On the team page, you can add new members by email so they can track time in your workspace. You can set people's billable rates and labor cost rates. Assign roles to either admin, project manager, or team manager. And edit information. In the Groups tab, you can create groups and add members to them to make team management easier. And in the Reminder tab, you can set up reminders so people who track too much or not enough time get an email. On the Client page, you can create new clients to group similar projects together, add their invoice information, and any notes you might have. Similarly, on the Tags page, you can create tags so you can add custom information to time entries. Plan who will work on what and when by creating a schedule. The Project tab shows you projects you've scheduled, their milestones, projected cost and billable amount, as well as who's assigned to them and how much easily create or edit assignments by dragging and dropping blocks. And on the Team tab, see your team's capacity at a glance and identify who's busy, who's available, and who's overbooked. All your track billable work and billable expenses can be invoiced through Clockify. 
You can quickly populate invoices with activities and expenses from specific projects, include taxes or discounts, and bill to specific clients. You can track invoice status, record payments, and send invoice reminders. And finally, utilize the workspace settings to make Clockify your own. Set up permissions, alerts, enable single sign-on, custom fields, integrations, import existing data, and see all changes made in the audit log. For more information on Clockify's features, make sure to watch our other videos or visit our website.